Hello, this is Andrew Olson from the Kansas City Juggling Club and here's my entry to the third annual International Jugglers Association video tutorial contest. This tutorial is on a simple 3D, 3 ball, juggling trick called the Triangle Wave. What is 3D juggling, you might ask? A couple basic varieties include a circular half shower with balls from one hand thrown in front of balls thrown from the other hand or tennis with one ball always kept in front of the other two. Obviously, I think we can do better than that. Rewind your mind back to the beginning. When someone is first learning how to juggle, 3D patterns are typically discouraged. Most juggling instructors will teach you to try to keep all of the balls in the same two-dimensional plane. It's a relatively common belief that adding a third dimension just complicates things, making your juggling life much more difficult and fragile. Besides, unless it involves crazy body throws or spinning yourself around in circles, which are fun but in a different class of 3D tricks, you might think 3D juggling just doesn't look very interesting. Well, hopefully this video will help to change that perception. So let's get this party started. First, here are some prerequisite tricks that you should be proficient with before trying to attempt a triangle wave. Cascade Reverse Cascade Tennis Little Tennis Tiny Tennis Half Shower Half Shower in the other direction And the Flying Octopus variation of Luke's Loop Start by throwing two regular cascade throws followed by two consecutive reverse cascade throws. Then repeat this four beat sequence. Keep repeating it. Keep repeating it. It might seem awkward initially, but eventually you should be able to become somewhat comfortable with it. It might help to count out loud. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Or if you like to talk fast, right under left under right over left over right under left under right over left over. That's all there is for the first level. Once you've mastered that with moderate fluidity, it's time to take it to the next level. Fortunately this next level is also the last level of learning how to juggle the triangle wave, an innovative 3D juggling pattern that will leave your audience amazed and your critics silenced. Back to the previous loop, notice that balls are thrown from three separate locations, middle, left, and right. A ball is launched from the middle spot twice in a row, when throwing the two regular cascade throws. The book and left and right spots are where the reverse cascade throws originate from. Don't worry about where your hands end up for the catches. That will come naturally. Just focus on where your hands are for the throws. Now, imagine that the three throwing locations are distinct points connected by a straight line. Then, imagine pushing the left and right points away from you, while keeping the middle point close to your chest. The straight line has been transformed into a V-shape, with throwing locations at the far left, middle close to you, and far right. What this means is that the regular cascade throw from your right hand will come from the close middle point and angle away from you and to the left, with the ball landing near the far left point. The regular cascade throw from your left hand will also come from the close middle point and angle away from you and to the right, with the ball landing near the far right point. The reverse cascade throw from your right hand will come from the far right and angle toward you and to the left, with the ball landing near the close middle point, and the reverse cascade throw from your left hand will come from the far left and go straight across at arm's length from your body, with the ball landing near the far right point. Here is the path that each ball takes. From above or below, it should look like a triangle. The balls circulate in a wave, hence the trick name, Triangle Wave. Of course the notions of left and right in this pattern are absolutely arbitrary and could be switched, but I've found it easier just to stick with the right left right left sequence for simplicity's sake. After a little bit of practice, you may notice that the cascade and reverse cascade labels for the types of throws in this trick become blurred, since you've escaped from 2D juggling prison and entered the wonderful world of 3D. I hope that you enjoyed this tutorial, and have lots of fun with the triangle wave and other 3D juggling adventures. 
Many thanks to the IJA for sponsoring this contest.